multiple natural disasters, a pandemic, record high inflation, there are numerous reasons why people are still struggling to make ends meet. Jade Moore reports local nonprofits need your help more than ever to continue helping others. We served 282 families last month. During that food pantry, we'll have anywhere between 1,100 to 1,500 people. Many Lake Area residents find themselves needing food to feed their families. Our numbers are up. Right now we are serving more because we know that food stamps have been cut and uh, people are out of work and people are looking for work. Um, between 400 to 600 cars will come through our food pantry. The effects of what started in 2020. It's been here since COVID, since the hurricanes especially are still being seen by volunteers and organizations now. We have them coming and calling every single day, needing emergency food supplies just to make it for a few days of, until the next paycheck. In fact, Water's Edge Church and Faith and Friends Food Pantry both say there has been an increase in the need for food in recent weeks. Rent is up. Everything is up. Groceries are up. It's your teachers. It's your law enforcement. We have people from all parts of the community coming to get food because they're hungry and they want to provide for their families. The best way to help, donating in the form of time or monetary donations. Food that we need to go and purchase, it comes directly out of our bank account, out of our pockets from the people that have donated to the church. Jade Morrow, 7 News. More information about food opportunities can be found on our website. Coming up next on